Good morning children. Hope you are safe at home. Today we will do lesson number 24 at the market. You have to look at the following pictures given to you on the left hand side and you have to read the conversations given on the right hand side. Then you have to match the conversations and the pictures by giving them numbers. So first let us number all the pictures. Write the numbers in the circle next to the picture. So number them from 1 to 8. Now let's start by looking at the first picture. What do you see in this picture children? It's a picture of a shop. There is a man who's come to the shop and is giving the shopkeeper a list. Now let's see. Which conversation will match this picture number 1? Let's read this conversation. The man says, Hello uncle, mother has sent this list of grocery items for the month. Can you deliver them today? And the man replies, Sure, we'll deliver them today. So this conversation matches the picture. Where this man is telling uncle, that is the shopkeeper, that his mother has sent a list of all the grocery items she needs for the full month. Grocery items is all the ration that we use in the house like sugar, tea, rice etc. And the shopkeeper uncle tells him, sure we'll deliver them today. So. Since we have matched it, you can write number 1 in the circle of this conversation box. Now let's go to picture number 2. Here you can see an old grandfather walking with his grandchildren on a street. And there is a man here who is selling some bubble machines and making bubbles on the road. Now let's read this conversation box. The child says, Grandpa, the bubbles look so lovely. Can we buy the bubble maker? And Grandpa replies, Why not? Let's buy three. Two for you children and one for me. So here the children have seen the bubble maker man blowing bubbles. And they are asking their grandfather to buy it for them. And grandpa agrees to buy two for them and one for himself. So this matches the second picture. So you can write number two in the box. Now picture number three. Here is a picture of a sugarcane shop. There's a lady and her son who have come to drink sugarcane juice. Now let's read the last conversation box. What does they say? The auntie says, Please give us two full glasses and don't put ice in the juice. Then her son who is sitting next to her says, But mama, I want some ice in my juice. So then mama tells the shopkeeper, Okay, put only a little ice in each glass. So picture number 3 matches to this conversation box. So write number 3 in the circle. In picture 4 you can see two ladies passing by a cake shop. So let's read this conversation box. The first lady says, Have you tried these cakes? They are so delicious. Delicious means tasty. The second lady replies, This is a new cake shop, is it? But I am not very fond of cakes. So here you can put number 4 in this box. Fifth picture, you have two people who are coming Next to a stall which is selling roasted corn, butta. 
now let's read this conversation box the man who's coming with the lady asked the lady do you like roasted corn cobs corn cobs means putta roasted is when the man roasts it on fire and cooks it so the lady replies to the man oh i love them with salt and lemon juice so the man tells her let's see at what price he is selling them so here both are then coming to the stall to buy some roasted corn cobs so this you can label as picture number 5 in picture number 6 you can see an old lady come to a shop and there are some sacks of rice so let's read the first conversation box the shopkeeper man in the shop says good morning aji aji we call for grandmother how can i help you aji says i want to buy rice for the whole year show me the varieties you have and tell me the prices so aji has come to select some rice from the shop so she's asking the shopkeeper to show her all the different kinds of rice he has and also the price or the cost of the rice the shopkeeper is replying back aji this variety is good don't worry about the price it is not very costly So here this is the conversation between Aji and the shopkeeper about rice. So this you can put as number 6. In the seventh picture, here you have a vegetable seller sitting and selling some vegetables like tomatoes and potatoes. There is a man come to buy some vegetables. But he has not bought anything. Let's see why. Let's read this conversation. The man says, "Give me some tomatoes." The lady who is sitting says, "Where's your bag?" The man replies, "I don't have one." Then the lady says, "Sorry, I don't keep plastic carry bags." So because both of them don't have bags the man cannot buy his vegetables or tomatoes that he wants so this you can put as number 7 now let's look at the last picture number 8 again there's a vegetable lady selling vegetables but here she is giving a bag to the man so let's read the second conversation box the lady says here are your potatoes would you like to buy tomatoes these are nice and fresh so the man takes the bag and replies sure wait i'll give you another bag for the tomatoes so this you can put as number 8 so in this way children we have matched the conversations to the picture you can practice these conversations at home too that is all for today children thank you and have a nice day